If you were looking for the easiest and fastest way of getting weapon XP in Modern Warfare 2 or for Warzone, here it is. I've been testing many ways out of what the fastest way of getting weapon XP is for Modern Warfare 2, and I think I have figured out how you can earn close to 100,000 XP in about 15 minutes. This is the best way to earn weapon XP in Warzone. This also works for leveling your character up as well, so literally anyone can do this, not just people who bought Modern Warfare. So if you play for free, you can take advantage of this as well because this works for for everyone before other people do this so don't miss out on this and if they nerf it you want to take advantage of this and i don't want to waste any more time on this and talking about it i want to go ahead and hop into this video so drop a like on this video right now and subscribe for more rose and content and if you want to get even more xp pop a quick double xp on weapons and on player yourself right now and let's get into it so to start this off loading to our zone and when you are flying in you want to look at the map and find as many of the intel missions and safe cracker missions available next to one another and preferably not in a hot spot when you do this otherwise you're going to run into enemies ruining your day the whole time and just trying to eliminate you and focus on you which is not what you want to do especially if you're just focusing on leveling up and gain that juicy extra weapon xp but you're gonna watch as my team wants you to drop in a hot spot and do the safe cracker mission so that's what we did end up doing but if you are more focused on leveling up your weapons stay away from that just look for the missions on the outside of the map and scout the missions up like I said, you're probably going to want to more focus on the Intel missions and also the Sif Cracker missions. The Sif Cracker gives you like 3,000... 200 something xp i believe and the intel gives you 5000 so the intel in the end does give you more weapon xp and more xp overall and once you have started the mission up and do the mission you want to try and find any weapon you want to level up before you finish the last safe or complete the last intel because at the end is when it rewards you with xp 